Hi, I'm Christina from Travels with Ted, and in today's RVing for Beginners video, I'm sharing 12 RV maintenance tasks that all new RV owners should know about. Regular RV maintenance will help keep your camper or motorhome out of the shop and on the road. Performing your own maintenance will save you hundreds of dollars each year. First up, repairing exterior seals. Keeping all of the seals around your RV's exteriors, doors, windows, and storage bays is critical for preventing water damage. Visually inspect the seals each month. Any spots with cracked, chipped, or thinning sealant needs to be resealed. Two, lubricate tank valves. The handles for RV black and gray tanks need to be lubricated. If they are not properly lubricated, the handles can stick and your black tank can get stuck in the open position. To prevent sticky handles, lubricate them regularly with a dry lubricant. Three, inspect tires. RV tires should always be inspected before travel. Start by checking the pressure of each tire. The recommended tire pressure is noted on the sidewall of your tires. Owning your own air compressor is ideal so tire pressure can be adjusted before driving. Also pay attention to the tread depth of your tires and use a tread depth gauge to measure it if needed. Don't forget to also inspect your spare tire. Spare tires should be inspected every 5,000 miles or at least every six months if you travel short distances. Four, inspect exterior stairs. Like all things in an RV, the entrance stairs need to be routinely inspected. The most common issue with stairs is screws coming loose during bumpy travel days. Check the screws every month or so to make sure they are secure and always have extra screws on hand in case one completely pops out. Five, check plumbing connections. The plumbing line connections in RVs are attached with clamps. These clamps can easily come loose during travel or due to high water pressure. Once a clamp detaches, water will flow out and can cause a major flood. These fittings should be checked regularly to ensure they are tight and undamaged. Carry extra clamps and a PEX crimping tool in your RV to repair any loose connections. Side note, it is always a good idea to turn off your water pump or the city water before leaving your RV. If a leak happens when you are away from your camper, it can turn disastrous quickly. Six, air conditioner maintenance. Rooftop RV AC units need to be cleaned and serviced at least once per year. Properly maintaining RV air conditioners is simple, but does require climbing onto the roof of your RV to inspect and clean the unit. Air filters inside the RV should be checked and cleaned regularly when the RV is in use. Seven, water heater maintenance. Another RV appliance that must be serviced annually is the water heater. Water heaters should be cleaned at least once every year to flush out sediment that has built up and prevent damage. Cleaning your water heater is a simple process that most RV owners should be able to do on their own. Eight, furnace maintenance. RV furnaces should also be inspected and if needed, cleaned annually. Furnace maintenance involves inspecting all the components for debris or obstructions and cleaning if needed. Nine, inspect safety equipment. All RVs should have both a fire extinguisher and a gas detector. RVs come with one of two types of fire extinguishers, rechargeable and disposable. If your fire extinguisher has a dial with a recharge and overcharge sections, it's rechargeable. Rechargeable extinguishers should be serviced every six years. Check with the local fire department to see if they offer this service. Disposable fire extinguishers have a dial that reads either full or empty. The fire extinguisher needs to be replaced if the dial points to empty. RV gas detectors also need to be replaced regularly. These detectors typically have a lifespan of about five years. If you have a used RV and don't know when the detector was installed, the production date is printed on the back. It's best to always have a replacement detector on hand so a new one can be installed as soon as the old one malfunctions. 10, inspect the roof. You should inspect your RV roof at least once per season. However, full-time RVers or frequent travelers may want to inspect their roof every month. Visually inspect all seams on the edge of the roof and around vents, racks, and appliances. Look for cracks or voids in the seals and add lap sealant to any areas where seals are damaged or missing. Then, check the roof for cracks, tears, or bubbles. If there is major damage to the roof, take your RV into a service center for repairs. 11. Sanitize your fresh water tank. RV fresh water tanks also need regular cleaning. These tanks should be sanitized on new RVs before your first trip, 
annually after long periods of storage and after any contamination. To sanitize your fresh water tank, simply empty the tank, fill it back up with a mixture of bleach and potable water, and let the solution sit for several hours, then thoroughly drain and flush the tank. 12. Recertify propane tanks. One RV maintenance item that must be completed by a professional is propane tank recertification. Portable propane tanks found on travel trailers and fifth wheels must be recertified every 10 years. To see when your tank was manufactured, check for a stamp near the top of the tank on the collar. The stamp should also state when the tank needs to be recertified, which is typically every 10 years. When it's time for recertification, head to Amerigas or another propane dealer that offers the service. Thanks for watching and happy camping.